to my channel and today we are going to do another unboxing this time of the ab roller it is ab roller rebound belly wheel let's look at the sides of this box the packaging you can do kneeling on both knees by paddle push type back to back this is kind of like a graphic of how to use it. Steps one, two, and three. And this is the ab roller, convenient to carry. The assembly procedure. This is step one, two, three, and four. This is product comes with two handles and one wheel. Align the right handle on the right side of the wheel and the left handle on the left side of the wheel. Press the button on the inner side of the handle while holding the handle firmly. Repeat the action above to insert the second handle. There's the bottom of the box and here is a self portrait of my stomach after trying this for a week no joke nah, i'm just joking no really guys i'm just bsing you there but um this is a picture of the ab roller rebound belly wheel and this is a good exercise this is a good exercise piece of equipment what we're going to do is we're going to do the unboxing now Right here is a tab that opens up. I don't believe it has any any stickers or anything. It just opens up just like that. Looks like there is this cushion pad right here. It comes with it. This is what the back of it looks like. I'm going to set that to the side. Now you know, I don't even have to say what this is because you guys already know. You guys already know. This is the instructions and this is very important. Okay? So I'm going to set that to the side for now. And this right here, you know, I'm not the brightest tool in the shed, but looks like it's just a blank piece of paper. Don't know what that would be used for. And then underneath here is some bubble wrap. And I'm going to pull it out of there. This looks like the ab roller. And on each side is the screws. Okay. So I'm gonna set that to the side. Let's see what else is in the box. We have a jump rope. That's cool. So this is a jump rope. And these are the handles to go on the sides of the ab roller. Right here, guys. Two handles. Now, since I'm opening everything, I'm going to open the jump rope too. Let's see what kind of quality this is. Oh, it has a zip tie there in the middle. Going to have to. Actually, I can just use a pair of fingernail clippers. Put that over the zip tie. Clamp down. And voila. Now here's the handles of the jump rope. Right here. They feel kind of light. But, you know, that could be on purpose. The ab wheel itself feels heavy duty. 
Anyways, guys, that was the unboxing of the ab wheel. Next, coming up, you're going to see the product demonstration. Okay, guys, in assembling this, you're going to have two handles. The instructions say left and right handle. Well, these aren't really labeled left or right. You can use them on either side. So, and on either side, it's going to have this bolt. What it does say to do is to push this in firmly and also put the one on this side and hold it firmly and then start pushing firmly in until you can feel the spring. until it's tight and flush onto the ab roller until it can't go anymore. And this side is gonna go the opposite direction. As this one will go forward, this one will go backward. And you wanna get them in tight. See, that way the ab wheel is tight. It has good uh, grip has a rubber grip on it right here. So just like that, the ab wheel is ready to build your abs and all put together and assembled. Okay guys, you have to warm up before you work on the ab wheel. Now common sense tells me they didn't put this jump rope and include it for no reason. So I'm gonna use this jump rope to warm up, okay? Here goes. Try to do this for 30 seconds. You are ready to work on the ab wheel. Now for the ab roller, what you guys need to do is put down this little pad right here onto a smooth surface. So that's what I'm doing right here. And you put your knees as far as you can on this pad right here. That way you don't scrape up your knees. All right, then you take the ab roller. It has a direction pointing this way. Once it's on the floor, make sure it's pointing in front of you. Now, as you go uh, push forward on the ab roller, you don't want to go all the way to the ground, but you want to go as slow as you can until you feel it in your stomach area. You're going to feel it kind of tense on you, and you hold it there for two seconds, and then you pull yourself halfway back up, not all the way, and then you go back down and do another rep. Kind of looks something like this. Go back up, then you go down for another rep. Don't touch the ground. Come back up. Just like that, guys. And that is the ab wheel, and I give it four out of five stars. <laughs> <laughs>